Over the past three years, the secondary division at Ishmik has focused upon the reinvigoration of learning in our community. Through creating an environment where student voice is paramount, technology is infused through student experiences and learning is placed within the context of real life situations. Part of our mission is to empower students and over the past few years we have enabled them to take an active leadership role in their school. Under the auspices of the community service executives, we have over 30 student-led groups taking an active role in the school and the community beyond. For example, the Titans of Tech, our online student newspaper, the Ishmik Inquirer, the Mindfulness Committee, who actually wrote our mindfulness curriculum, Students Teaching Students, where local Vietnamese children are taught English by our students, and students creating and hosting international conferences such as Escape Room Maths. The Titans of Tech are a student-led group that allows students and teachers to build their ability and also their knowledge. We participated in an online phenomenon known as Hour of Code. We allowed the students to participate in learning how to code so that we can foster that passion or that interest in coding so that they can take that into their later stages of life. It's our robotics club, which at the, right, uh, which at the moment is in its developmental stages. And so this allows students to participate in further coding, including um, some physics in terms of electronic circuits and combining the two to create uh, a certain creation that they wish. And so speed geeking is a form of like speed dating, but for technology, it's completely student-led. At Ishmik, we believe that technology should be used to redefine student learning and to support and drive creativity and innovation. Ishmik infuses technology to ensure it is at the vanguard of creative problem solving and enables our students' opportunity to collaborate and bond with local and global industries. At Ishmik we've been using technology to help us develop our phys ed program over the last three or four years and it's really started to boost what our kids can do. What we try to do is use a lot of our smart devices, iPads, smartphones to do a lot of video and image capture so that we can show the kids so they can look at breaking down their own movements and comparing and contrasting what they're doing to what an ideal or a professional looks like. We are a group of students that run the service groups here at Ishmik and um, we have over 30 cast groups and uh, we are currently working on getting away from the idea that service is just about fundraising. Mindfulness is the centering of your soul and your mind and it is extremely helpful for education especially in the morning because some students they have a lot of stress on um, on themselves. They have a lot of homework and a lot of work. So by doing mindfulness just for 10 minutes every day, they don't have to worry about anything else. Personal Project has given me the opportunity to explore my interests and more importantly to engage in the athletic link with the community. My personal project goal is to create a library for Dong Hung Thuong Community House and inspire students there to read. I will develop and sustain my charity group further in the future with the possibility of turning it into a fully formed NGO within the next two years. In grade six, we held the Makers Arcade where students were able to design and code their own video games and connect them to the Makey Makey. We used Scratch as a computer coding program and they were able to come play our games and give the students valuable feedback so that they could improve on their games. The concept behind the breakout box is where students are able to use clues from around the room to be able to find a way to get into the box. With this project, students were able to gamify their own learning by creating their own breakout boxes. This year, after a major curriculum invigoration, our focus has been on embedding authentic assessment into our curriculum. At Ishmik, authentic assessment is assessment that has relevance to the actual lives of our students and is pertinent to an authentic audience. An example of this is when our design students collaborated with a Swedish company to design and create furniture products which were then built and sold as a product in the local and international market. The grade nines uh, at our school, um, what our objective was to increase the capacity of which each system uh, at Ishmael could be used at. So for example, the cafeteria, traffic around school, just to name a few. Some of the solutions have actually been implemented 
in the arts department we've been focusing on authentic assessment. As an art teacher we become a bit complacent with that term, it's easy to say that's what we do, we're always working towards a show, it's authentic, people are going to see it, but what can actually happen is that you then take the emphasis off the process and that's often where the really rich learning happens. So we wanted to try and make sure as a department that we didn't do that. We started introducing our units to students as design briefs and we found that students have really responded to this uh, for a couple of reasons. First of all because they're actually navigating that idea of the audience, it's no longer just their teacher or just their parents. It also helps them to develop their visual literacy um, and we think that the quality has improved because they're thinking about people outside of their immediate social group actually seeing the work. Be able to combine um, the unit which was about poetry with something that really was an authentic piece of work um, in terms of graffiti like you know street art and graffiti are extremely important culturally and a growing movement in Ho Chi Minh City so the unit was something that was based on the idea that creativity involves artistry. Through Ishmik's mission to energize, engage and empower we in the secondary division are striving to ensure learning is authentic, creative, fun and will last forever.